okay? Now, the last question that we've got is around how can we connect multiple document libraries under one Microsoft Teams environment? So we'll stay in this same team because we can see that we've got, uh, what, we'll, what we're gonna do is I'm going to create a new document library inside of Retail and let's call this um, uh, Policies. All right, so we'll create a new library called Policies. Now that's sitting outside of Teams because remembering Teams uses this, this default document library here, but we want maybe surface this library inside of Teams. So what we can do is we can add a tab and we can add the SharePoint tab. So we'll go to SharePoint and what we can do here is we can then add that Policies library as a tab. So I'll go to document libraries. We can see that I'm in the retail uh, team, document libraries, policies, and I'll hit save. Now what that's doing is, is now incorporating that new library as a tab inside of my Microsoft team. Now that can be added to any channel. So we can do the same thing in other channels. Uh, and then we've got the files tab which is our general folder in our default document library. And we've also got our policies tab here that is surfacing and uh, giving us the ability to, uh, to utilize that new document library from the site. So there we go, three questions all answered uh, in this uh, episode of AMA or Ask Me Anything. Uh, if you do have any questions, subscribe to the channel, hit me up in the comments or on LinkedIn, um, hit me up on LinkedIn there, provide um, anything that you want answered, hit me up there and you may feature in the next AMA. Thanks for watching, see you in the next episode.